So in the last part we saw how Godzilla attacked that death bird with his explosive bomb and there was also a wolf in that explosive bomb. So in the beginning of this part we see that the bird survives that attack. And the wolf goes upwards and directs that attack towards the bird whose hit falls on this bird and then with the help of multiple attacks the wolf attacks the death bird with great speed and this attack now the bird starts falling down. Then after this this girl is also watching and says that we will reach there soon. On the other hand, this bird starts getting very angry, then it kills all its companions. Asks to go after that girl and at the same time that bird is also following that girl but this girl is very fast and moving fast but this bird does not understand after all why has this girl brought me to this place of reptiles which are already finished but all are with her when she enters the cave of reptile king they don't know that the king reptile has been killed. But still they are very scared and at the same time this girl has now reached inside the cave but she sees no one is coming after her. She is not able to understand. Why is she not coming after the bird? What happened? She is still afraid of that reptile king. So she is not coming here. Then only in that cave a dangerous sound starts coming from inside and after hearing this. All the bird's companions get very scared and start running from there and the bird says why are you running idiots? that is the name of reptile king. There is no sound and we look inside so really this girl is making the sound of reptile king which is very strange and now the bird starts getting very angry. And she says you cowards go out of my way go and at the same time we see the wolf who is watching all this from a distance and after that the bird also sees the wolf and then the wolf bites the rock near it and drops it directly towards this side so that the rock falls on this bird and it starts going inside the cave and then suddenly Godzilla rolls and directly attacks this bird so that now both of them they start falling inside the cave and after a while Godzilla comes in his original form and says that really I am in a lot of pain. In this human form I become very weak but he he starts looking here and there. Then a girl comes in front of him who has now come in human form and who is looking very beautiful and Godzilla goes to that girl and starts making fun of this girl. And then this girl starts biting Godzilla, which hurts Godzilla very much and this girl says how dare you fight with me and then after that when Godzilla looks at her neck, it hurts there after seeing this. When Godzilla tries to touch her wound, the girl removes his hand and gives it to him. After eating, Godzilla apologizes to that girl. But this girl really has a lot of ego and then someone comes behind this girl and says don't try to move and puts a sword on her neck. The wolf comes behind this girl and says if you try to move then I will cut your neck and now there Godzilla says really you are very arrogant girl it is very difficult to persuade you when all three of us together if we live then we can face any disaster and this girl says what do you think I am weak I am very powerful you have no idea what my feathers are how precious I am very comfortable with you thieves but Godzilla says if you transform into that bird again then you might have become a complete jerk and the girl says what do you think I can't turn back into a monster I will swallow you alive but Godzilla says that no matter how much you try in this cave you will not be able to escape from us you are very weak but tell me, how did you get the scar on your neck, which has not even healed yet? Then this girl says that knowing you what will you do? I have killed those reptiles because of which I got this wound. Killed many comrades and ate their poison inside my body, it went away. But only then King Kong, she says, you do not know who is my brother, he has explosive fire, because of which we can cook those reptiles very easily can eat without any problem then this girl also says yes it is true this nub has such a flame which can kill reptiles but Godzilla says so will you corporate with us fight with reptile king in doing this. This girl says that you are very sad, you want to impress me, you will not be able to do it even in your dreams, and she starts leaving from here, removing the wolf's sword, then this Godzilla starts to persuade this fussy girl that we should live together that's why we have to know about each other and he tells about himself that I am Lin Shen and I came from sea and in this beautiful place I found this girl then Godzilla asks Wolf after all, tell me how did you get the weapons of humans and how are you martial arts like humans? Do you know in bird you also tell me about yourself and this wolf says that I do not want to tell you now. We have not even become friends, then this girl starts making fun of the wolf. 
Then this wolf says that I I am not like you I never leave my friends I always protect them like a family the girl says do you consider yourself a saint just you have a piece of iron so can you save them all and after hearing this the wolf starts getting very angry and then Godzilla tries to pacify both of them and then Godzilla asks but bird tell me where did you get the transformation fruit and you how did it come to know that a crystal shell comes out of it. Then this girl says why should I tell you, I am not going to tell you anything. Really this girl has a lot of ego, after all, why are girls like this, and after hearing this, Godzilla's condition gets worse then he buys that fruit from his system mall and then after that he gives a fruit to this girl and says that you should eat it quickly so that all your wounds will be healed and your nervousness will also go away. Then she gets angry and says that all because of you what is happening is your whole family will be upset and that fruit kills her on Godzilla. This girl is a very fussy girl and Godzilla says that. This is a live fruit that can heal wounds and King. Kong also says that really it can heal all wounds and. By the way even this bird is not able to understand from where it got this fruit and King Kong is very much confident maybe it is really the same fruit and it the boy has become very smart while living with King Kong and then Godzilla also gives a live fruit to the wolf and says that you remember how injured I was when we first fought but after eating this fruit after that all my wounds have been healed and the girl who was there was also cured because of this fruit. Then the wolf says that if it is like that then it is fine and I am right now because of this. I have been in the human body for a long time and my martial arts always grow by kissing myself, we have to break our limits and after hearing this, Godzilla applauds the wolf, but this wolf is down he falls because he is very tired right now and even Godzilla does not understand why this is happening. Then Godzilla says that the power of the transformation fruit inside you is not your body. So eat this fruit quickly, after which your body will be able to resist the valiant energy inside your body, Otherwise you will not be able to turn into a monster again, but I can help you from human to monster, after which you can easily switch your body. And when this girl hears that Godzilla knows how to change from human to monster and change from monster to human, this girl can't believe how Godzilla can do this. It seems that there is no chemical man somewhere but Godzilla says that it is not impossible, it is possible. Can turn into human that still this girl is not believing. That after all someone can comfortably resist the energy of the transformation fruit then Godzilla says you people are still not believing so I bring the fruit I can tell you comfortably how you can increase your ability and after hearing this this girl gets very angry because the transformation fruit which is already destroyed but Godzilla he says then from where did you give the transformation fruit to this wolf and after that both of them fight again. People say that the one who fights the most, loves more. Is it possible that now the wolf will fall in love with this girl and this girl will fall in love with this wolf in the future? It will be known in the next episode as well the one who is Godzilla stops these two from fighting but it does not make much difference. Then after this this girl tells that I had already kept some fruits. Then this girl says that I should give you some fruits. I can but but first you have to prove me how you can change from a person to a monster if you really can control the power of that transformation fruit then maybe I can join you and after hearing this Godzilla he becomes happy and this girl tells that I did not want to tell you about that fruit where it is but I am telling that it is in the fruit skeleton swim and that fruit tree is there is hidden and when the wolf hears this it says that it is a very dangerous place will we ever be able to go and after hearing this the girl says yes because you are scared and again now they both start fighting with each other and fight a lot then after that Godzilla asks King Kong are you in that place this girl refuses. Then after that Godzilla says what kind of place is it? Then starts telling that the place is very dangerous. It is a graveyard of monsters. Where very dangerous creatures live there is always smoke in that place so you can't see very far there are very dangerous plants that eat flash and this girl says so do you still want to go and the wolf says Godzilla got you there but should not go and especially not for me. That place is very dangerous, no monster can go there and Godzilla says that there must be flesh eating plants at that place, just you guys tell me its direction, I will go there. But I will definitely go and after hearing this the wolf becomes very surprised and this girl says will you really go to that dangerous place for this wolf and Godzilla says this is my friend I will definitely go for this and I have to prove myself and with him King Kong also agreed to go and now both of them they are very happy. Really there is a very good bonding between these two, which both of them are also watching. Then after that this girl says, after all you guys have already decided, 
so I will arrange eagle dodos for the trip. Godzilla says that there is no need for this, I and King Kong will go there comfortably and after hearing this, the wolf says, don't you know that place is called graveyard, that two of monsters, there are big monsters. Can't stay alive till there is a swamp that's why you guys take the dodos so that your energy will be saved and after hearing this Godzilla says that really you are right I will definitely go sitting on those dodos. But Godzilla says why are you guys not eating this fruit are you guys still scared I think this girl is scared to eat it then the wolf after that eats that fruit and at the same time the girl also eats it but it tastes very bitter and only then the wound of the wolf starts to heal and also this girl also gets orgasm. Don't know why it is so seeing this. I am enjoying very much. Such a thing is not seen every day and after seeing that all their wounds are moving very fast. If it is happening then it becomes very happy and eats the fruits very fast and the most happy too are this death bird. Maybe all its feathers would have come back. Then after this this girl Godzilla says. Do you have any more live fruit? Then Godzilla says in attitude. This is my fruit after dinner. Which I eat. In fact. Godzilla is a Faku man. After that they all come out and this bird says that when you go over there just take one fruit it is very precious but Godzilla says don't say so much I also want only one then the bird whistled K calls his companions and after seeing this, now both of them become very happy and Godzilla says that you do not need to take much tension of your companions and start getting transformed and come in your original form. They go and after seeing this this girl says will I really be able to transform so easily and now all three start their journey to go to skeleton swim and while going it is evening and now Godzilla as their King Kong starts feeling hungry and he says that the skeleton swim is not far so we will go there tomorrow morning and King Kong says I am going hunting and Godzilla says I am going to light a fire. I find wood for the fire and now it is night and all three are cooking meat comfortably and eating meat with pleasure and most this wolf is more happy. It is eating this kind of meat after a long time and it remembers its master that how its master used to give it barbecue to eat. This wolf starts crying and their Godzilla man takes out dis which is chicken and now with great fun these people eat their food sometimes I feel very bad for this wolf but what to do this is the law of the jungle then after that Godzilla asks about the wolf and the wolf says that when the time is right, I will tell you everything about me. First of all, we have to come alive from that skeleton swim. You have no idea how dangerous that place is. One of my the fellow has escaped from there and he told me everything about the place that there are so many dangerous monsters who always attack from hiding. It is a very dangerous place where big monsters are sneaking let's attack but Godzilla doesn't care much then Godzilla asks can you tell me after all who are you are you a monster or a hunter there is crystal inside you then you have to break it you don't have much strength in human form because of which you can die so you have to come back to your original form and I will give you I can't see dying like this. Really now these people are strengthening their bonding. Sometimes I also miss my friends after seeing such a mangua. Then the wolf comes to a lonely place and is thinking that I haven't even answered his question yet but still he has accepted me as his friend really they both are very good like a wolf cub and a starling in the tree is looking at these two from above and says it is really very simple people and now we see the same dangerous place where many dangerous monsters are waiting for these three and then after that it is morning and all three leave for their journey. And at the same time now they also reach that place but the fog is not that much but still the wolf says you be careful there are many dangerous monsters here and King Kong also says this tree it looks very strange I feel strange wolf says we don't have to go far all three of us close have to stay close and then suddenly something comes in front of them and which happens to be a mantis dead tree which has a length of 7 meters and weighs 6.5 tons. Their legs are very sharp. Then after this. This mantis attacks King Kong, but at the right time, King Kong escapes from his attack and an attack of mantis falls on that dodo bird and there it rests in peace. And as soon as King Kong comes to the ground, his leg gets stuck in that swamp and as soon as Godzilla sees it, he says King Kong, don't try to move and also mantis. He is about to attack both of them but only their butt. The wolf comes and because of which the attack of this mantis does not fall on both of them and they are saved but mantises are continuously attacking them and at the same time the wolf comes to know that its cell is too much it is hard and now these people start running away from here and this mantis also starts following them and mantis does an attack so that another dodo bird dies but the wolf survives the attack and the wolf says take the girl quickly and get out of here. 
till then I distract her and attack this mantis and cut her into small pieces in a very stylish way. And now as soon as it is about to fall, then Godzilla comes there and saves this wolf and these people see that this mantis was very dangerous and two of their dodo birds have been killed in there but now the wolf says that it is still not too late, we should run away from here, but Godzilla says that if we go empty handed, that ugly bird will laugh at us, so now these people start moving forward and say Godzilla. It is said that wolf you cut these trees with the help of your sword and King Kong can easily climb these trees and King Kong climbs trees and then suddenly a mantis attacks both of them from behind. But the wolf comes to know and so he jumps up with Godzilla and that mantis attacks this dodo bird and seeing this I feel very bad for the dodo birds because the dodos in our world there are birds, their number is very less and in this mangua all these dodo birds are being killed openly, really I feel very bad. Let's rest in peace and now Godzilla is climbing the tree with great difficulty and there are many mantises. And the wolf says that we have to climb up quickly otherwise it may be very difficult for us and now these mantises now let's try to fly and really they are flying in the air don't know what is going to happen to these three and Godzilla says I forgot that mantis can fly too and now mantis will attack these three they reach to attack and also attack and the wolf is able to escape from their attack with great difficulty and at the same time it is attacking them and also attacks on Godzilla. But Godzilla attacks that mantis escapes and after that they all come forward to attack them with great speed and Godzilla says that these people are bullying a small child, do these people want to fight with me and now saying this Godzilla jumps on top of a mantis then after that he charges himself to bite and does a dangerous bite to this mantis. What if Godzilla consumes the power of this mantis? In the last of this video, I want to tell you that all the chapters of Reborn as a Monster were in English, I recap them and all the remaining chapters are in Chinese language, I have translated those chapters in English, I will try to translate and that's why subscribe my channel like video will come you will get notification, until then you will have to wait a bit, so see you in another video, and now goodbye to me.